Hey everybody, I'm Dirtshot Challenge. I'm having some webcam issues. Hopefully this works. If not, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Um, welcome to Millie's Nights 4. It's a fan-made FNAF game. So I thought, hey, let's let's give it a try. Let's see how this goes. Music box on Cam B3, night one. I don't know the controls. I... Ah. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, hello? Hello, hello. Uh, hi. hi. Hello there, little kiddo. And you should be inside that garage, right? Well, good, no. because there are nightmares and monsters that will be haunting you soon. But are there? this night, I don't think you really need to bother about them. But what you do need to know are the basics. Oh, God. So, first things first. First, you have a flashlight that you could activate by pressing space. Second, Yay. in the monitors, there are flashing lights that you could turn off to blind any animatronics that come nearby. But cool. none of them should be coming by now. Well, and there's also a music box at one of the cams. Don't know which one, but you'll figure it out. Uh, B3. Anyway, so the reason why we're in the garage is because... Well, there is the garage door behind you, but that one you don't need to worry about at all. That doesn't explain but why we're in a garage. You don't worry about the two doorways because that's where all the electronics will be coming by. But what about the because garage? You got cameras inside the house, a part of your garage, and in the back. None of them are working. So, yeah. Also, be careful when using the flashing lights because. It, they will need a recharge every now and then, okay? I'm confused. Anyways, gotta go. Hopefully you survive for the first night. Remember to wind up the music box and keep an eye on the camera. Why are we here? Got it? Okay, bye. No one explained anything to me. How long am I supposed to be here for? It just keeps saying 1 a.m. Am I done? Did I make it? Yeah, hooray! Hooray! It just says 1 a.m. Nothing's happening. Cameras don't work. Ah, it's 2 a.m. now. I'm working five nights at Millie's. Oh! Okay. What? What? Where did that per- what? No, is there more than one night? I can't continue. Yeah, I don't. I don't need to listen to you. I guess the music box. I let that go, and I died. What does the flashlight do? No, the cameras work. What am I doing? <laughs> oh! Oh! I get- you have to turn- Okay. I have to hold the flashlight down to see anything in the hallways. What about outside? Okay. I'm getting- I'm getting what you're putting down. Hello? I heard movement. God, these nights last forever! Oh god, it's 3 a.m.? Oh god. This isn't scary, this just feels tedious. I'm gonna give some creative advice. If nothing's gonna happen on the first night, don't... Don't make it last, like, 15 minutes. Because this isn't fun. This isn't, like, enjoyable. This is just taking so long. See? That makes me wonder. It won't let me continue. It won't let me continue. 
Oh, come on! Okay, it, okay, there it goes. Ah, that was so... Why wouldn't it let me continue? Hi. Hi. I can't answer uh, the phone. Hello there, little kid. Nice to see you again later night. I'm a little Anyways, kid? So, have you been able to see any electronics last night? Wait, you did near 5 or 4 a.m.? Well, no. in that case, I better teach you a little bit of the more basics. Now, if any of the electronics do roam around the house, keep an eye on them. If you do feed them, but then later on they'll feed them any more cameras, that means that they're in the doorways. So, just keep an eye at them, and then you can flash the doorway lights at them. Also, just to let you know, remember what I said last night about they have the ray charge? Well, it turns out there might be two animatronics that will try to get you. Well then. Anyways, so that's really mostly all, but like last night, remember to wind up the music box. See you next night. But why? I'm not freaked out by this. I thought this would be scary. I'm not scared. I was scared when I forgot the uh, timer. If I saw an animatronic now, I'd be freaked out by it, but I'm not seeing any. I think this is what you re when you realize like what makes Five Nights at Freddy's scary is like the resource management of it. You know, like what's what what's really scary is when you when you can fight back, but you're limited. Like I'm unlimited right now. So even though there's like oh there's a there's a time charge, I haven't seen animatronics at all. And the rewind is, like, it takes three seconds to cool down, so, like, I'm not afraid. Alright. That got me. There's an animatronic. There we go. Now something's happening. Hey. How you doing? Hey. Freaky duck thing. Still in B5? Okay. Hey, oh. Hey! How you... How you doing? Freaky duck thing? We cool? Hi! Bye. Go away now. Shoo shoo. I'm not gonna hurt you. Okay. I feel like that's a lie. Oh, rendering's done. Hi, bunny. Where's your... Okay, where'd the, where'd the duck go? I'm not gonna hurt you. I feel like you're lying to me. Personally. I haven't seen the duck in a while and I'm getting a little worried now. See, now it's getting good. Now we're getting somewhere. I thought you liked me. Don't you still I don't know what you're talking about. I never liked you, so, personally, no. You guys got, oh, there's the duck again. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quacks. Quack, quacks. Whoa! Hey! I'm working. Come out and let's have fun. <laughs> That, I know you weren't intending to go for funny, but that, that, that sounded funny to me. Oh. Are you gone? Yep, do the flashies. 
I'm not gonna hurt you. Yes, you are. You're gonna jump scare me because you're a bunny, animatronic, and a horror game. So you're gonna hurt me. That's just logic. You like give me like a like a weird voice prompt whenever you show up. I'm not gonna hurt you. See, now I do this and he's there. Hi. Hi. Night three. Let's do this. I want to be scared. Like, you know what I'm saying? Let's pick up. Yay, kiddo. For night. Let's do this anyway. So, the electronics seem to be getting more active during the night. I just realized that. I'm pretty sure you might have a lot earlier by now. No. Anyway, so, do you know that camera where there's like the little shed thing in the backyard? Well, no. that is where Nightmare Max Lee hangs out. And you have to keep an eye on him. If he leaves, then he will immediately run toward your office and you just have to shine a flashlight at him. Which? That's simple. But, you will hear him running towards the office when he's about to charge at you, which kind of gives you a little hint that he's coming. Yeah, I think you gave anyway, too many so hints. apart from that, I've looked at some of the images of what's in the music box. You might have not seen them, might have, but it looks pretty creepy. It's just a floating head that could literally get you. Anyway, so apart from that, do you realize that... You know, actually, I'll talk about that in the next night, but apart from that, be sure to wind up the music box, shock the electronics if they're near your doorway, and yeah, as simple as eating the chicken breast through, you know what, ignore that joke. Anyways, see you next night. Yeah, see you next night. <laughs> what am I even doing? Oh, it's 1 a.m. already. Woo! At least the nights are going faster. Oh. There you are. Yep. I don't know which one's the shed. Is this the shed? Is this the shed? Which one's the shed? And you're still over there. Hi. How you doing? Gonna try and jump scare me? You're in B6. Hey. I hear a door. Okay. I hear a door. And I'm not certain what that means for me. Hi, door. 2 a.m. It's, yeah, it's going much faster now. Like, I heard the door. But I don't, like, see where the door Hi, Bonnie. See, now you're all like, I'm not gonna hurt you, I'm not gonna hurt you. Now you're like, come on, let's have fun. Like, you know, I knew you were full of shit, dude. I knew you were full of shit. You don't want to have fun, you want to eat my face. And personally, I'm not a fan of people. I'm not gonna hurt you. Don't you lie to me, alright? Just don't you lie to me. Okay. I hear walking. Millie, er, duck, duck lady's over in B5. He's over in B2. Come out and let's have fun. Now he's over there. Hey, buddy. I'm not creeped out by this. Like, I tried playing Five Nights at Freddy's. Yep, you're over there now. I tried playing Five Nights at Freddy's. It actually freaked me out. Uh, because the resource management and everything is so difficult. But this isn't really difficult. This is actually pretty easy. See? Like, I'm good at this. I'm decent at this. I, I hear... Ah, there you are. There you are. I see you now. Now you're back. Hi. You got... 
close to the camera, didn't you? I almost let that go down. You're still there. Hi. Hey. No, I don't like you. I don't like any of you. I don't even know why I'm here. Hi. See, here's the thing. Right, right, the like, right here's the thing. Uh, I flash the lights now. Because he, he gives himself away. So, there's not really much, like... Hey. Like, I'm not afraid of these guys. Except for, uh... Duck Lady. This duck right here. Because the duck... Oh, God! Like, yeah, I... Yeah, okay. I'm not afraid of, like... The duck lady, I'm afraid of. But now that I know the blue guy, I have so much time. I have so much time, and I don't have to, like, manage any resources, really, except for this box. So it's like, I'm not afraid of it. Oh, and I can flash my lights from anywhere. Okay, never mind. I was scared of the running, because I thought, oh, I'm going to get jump scared. But then it's like, no, he just stands there. So it's just not as, um... It's just not as freaky. Or as scary as it could be, I guess. I wish the knights would go a little faster, too. Hey. Like, I can just do this. Like, I don't even have to look at him. I can hit space and the flashlight works. So, it's not scary to me. You know? And I've never played, like, I've never fully played a FNAF game. But I feel like I'm pretty good at this. Hi. You're in B6 now. Ah! Rah! You're in B1. You're here. See, that's why I'm saying it's not freaky. Because you give yourself away. Duck... Duck doesn't give itself away, except for when the mirror or the window breaks. Hey, you're gonna come up. Yep. Go away. Thank you. I'm not gonna hurt you. You're in B2 now. Hi. I'm working five nights at Freddy's. And I've been here all week. I'm not gonna Flashy, hurt flashy, you. flashy. All right, well, I've been recording for 30 minutes, so I'm going to leave this episode here. Um, yeah, I actually, like, I wasn't that scared. I felt like uh, a lot of the scares were too, um, too televised. Like, y you can't, um, y you can't make it that scary if you're, if you're, like, letting me know every single time. You know, I think it would be better if you just naturally let the players figure it out rather than giving it away so much. Like, uh, you know, saying that, oh, you'll hear the running whenever they're going to come at you. That'd be nice, but it's it's too forgiving, I guess is what I should say. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys liked this episode. See you later, navigators. Bye! Hey, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, leave a thumbs down. Either way, tell me in a comment down below. If you have any ideas for games you'd like to see me play on the channel, go ahead and leave that in the comments down below. And subscribe to become a navigator so I can finally know where the hell I'm going.